what's the process of working with schools? Welcome back to another Questions with Dee, where I answer your questions about personal and professional development, about my journey, and really anything else that you want to know. Now, while I can't really answer this completely in just one video, if you have specific questions, do let me know. But if you are going to work with schools, I would recommend starting with having a purpose in mind. So being very clear on what the value is that you can offer the students, what the outcome is, because if the teachers or the staff are going to invest in you or want to work with you, they need to know how that's going to impact the students. Secondly, you need to make sure that you have your police background check, specifically the vulnerable sector check, and also insurance because the board and the staff want to know that their students are going to be safe with you. And uh, there's also something called the approved vendor list, and it's different in each of the different boards, but you need to get yourself on that approved vendor list. And that could look like filling out a survey. It could look like responding to a bid. It is different for different school boards. Um, but in order to be a vendor to the schools, you need to be on the approved vendor list. So I would say start there if you would like to work with schools. If you have other questions, drop them in the comments or send me a DM.